what I noticed is you weren't afraid to try something new. From that quick description, you had tried so many different things. What allowed you to move from one job or one experience to another uh, and not get stuck where you were? Failures and falling in love. These are ah, the two that. moments where I learned something. Failures, so failures and falling in love. Good, good. Yeah, like there are only two things. Failures happen all the time. Every hour I have some form of failure. I try a CRM, it's the wrong one. Uh, I, I hire people, wrong people. And then I hire people, great people, but then they, after two months, I lose them. So failure happens all the time. Uh, I, I create a video, nobody, <laughs> nobody needs it. So failure, I have like five, six failures every day. And I learn from that, right? In a negative way. Okay, nobody needs this. Okay, I learn from it and move on. How do you learn from it? Because we, we have a process we call the debrief, but a lot of the debrief is you're also self-reflection. You're doing that all the time. But, but how do you move so quickly? Because I agree with you, I'm constantly off. I'm constantly making mistakes and correcting form. How do you do it? Yeah. So if you want to describe it, it's, it's a loop uh, after action review. What was the assumption? Mm -hmm. What did I do? What came out? What's the gap? So what? <laughs> this, would, this would be the five steps. But I don't do a formal after action yeah. review with myself. But you, you just feel it, right? It's like when your kid, your kid is grumpy and it's two years old and they go, ah, papa, ah, and you try first thing. You want a banana? No. Okay. Okay. They're not hungry. And then, oh, let's let's look at the clock. Oh, okay, uh, it's the time. It's, it's time to sleep for them, right? Okay. And so that's how it's more an inaction thing, but right. it's really five steps. Observe, try, measure, and then validate or invalidate your assumption and then action again. Yeah. So yeah. that's the loop, but it happens more in a natural way. And uh, so I try stuff, doesn't work, move on to the next. And as soon as something works, that's the part that I call falling in love. You feel it. When something is right, yeah. you feel it. Yeah. Your body knows it. Right? And so that's why experimentation is important and discovery is important. You move through different landscapes. And when you are in the right place, you feel it. Everything is in line. 